What's going on, everybody? My name's Chris, and welcome back to some more exciting Let's Play on Original Craft. Oh, yeah, on Original Craft. Look at that. I'm looking the spawn area. I think if we die, we actually spawn right around there. Um, I was actually trying to find the tree we all started on, but I'm not entirely sure which one it is. And this will be the first time uh, I've recorded since the server reset. Um, you guys are seeing this little after. The server reset was on the 14th of March, so, whoa, whoa, what? Oh, okay, I was really confused, I don't have a sword, I'll just use this. Give me your stuffs! Give them to me, all of your stuff- ow! Did he give me his stuffs? He didn't give me his stuff, he just gave me a raw taters. Sheesh. Actually, there hasn't been too many mobs spawning around- oh, okay. <laughs> does, this, does this lead anywhere in particular? I'm really curious. It was just kind of a path to my death. I didn't. My intention was not to do this, uh, to follow this path. We're probably following this path. Look at look how cool this all looks. I am really a fan. Well, like, what is this? You may be asking. It's actually the clouds. Since we're so high up in the sky, the clouds are here <laughs> to show us the way. It actually gives like a cool like swamp kind of feel. Everything's all misty and stuff. I really like it. It's cool. Mist should totally be a weather thing in Minecraft, but it isn't. Is this path end? It's, oh, no. It goes over here. I don't know why I'm following the, through the jungle, and I'm lagging a bit. Okay. Let's just jump through this quickly. Oh, good lord. I'm getting some lag. I'm going to probably have to... Oh, I'm going to have to reset the recording in a second here. God dang it. This issue was fixed. I actually have a different recording software I could try to figure out instead of Fraps, since it's apparently a lot better, but I have yet to figure it out. How it works. <laughs> I actually tried before, but it didn't work. But I think it was by editing issue. Why am I? Why am I even doing this? There is no reason. I just want to see where this goes. Mostly, like it kind of curves to the right here. I'm trying to avoid creepers. I don't want no explosions. I think we might be approaching the skyfall zone. Actually, hmm. Yes, indubitably. So, this episode. We're actually gonna check out spawn once we figure out where the heck this leads. I just really wanna know. If it leads past like the sky falls on you... Whoa, whoa, what is that? Looks like some kind of like runway. Is there gonna be a plane over here? Oh, there's a village. Whee! Oh man, it's gonna be annoying to get back. You see I've actually enchanted this pick already. I've just been kind of enchanting picks and uh digging around spawn to help set start getting that set up. But nothing really exciting. What is this? Cool village over here. I'm sure everyone's been eaten. See some cool mounds over. Oh, it looks really cool. Where does that lead? Well, there's only one way to find out. <laughs> this probably just leads to someone's mind. I probably shouldn't do this. You know what? Let's not. That's just that's just gonna lead to someone's mind. Like if I was disorientated, I might think, oh, that leads back to spawn. But no. Does this continue? <laughs> All right, there's an arrow. Is there no? There's no. <gasps> Holy crap! Ha, ha, Don't do a creeper. I stopped to scratch my nose. Holy crap! Okay, I I will see you guys uh, momentarily when I get back to spawn, and I will be completely okay and not dead. <laughs> see you guys in a second. And I'm back, and hopefully my leg jumpy thing is fixed. I I reset it. Um. Minecraft and Fraps, that is. Hoping that might do something. I don't freaking know. It almost doesn't feel like it's a Fraps problem. Because even when I stopped recording, I was still getting jump, jump. It was jumping around a lot. And by the way, I really like this farm. I don't know. It's really simple, but it's really cool. It's got a little hut that's made of cocoa beans, the things we farm. So this is pretty much everyone's stuff. Um, here's my sneaky oven. I don't even know how much I, um, I, I'm showing from the first episode of this. I haven't, I haven't edited that yet. Woo! <gasps> Ooh, is that my chicken? I don't know. It's in my chest. See, it says, Chris's chest, no touching me boobies. I, I don't know. <laughs> and this was also my chest, but stuff keeps changing. <sighs> I mean, I could kind of understand if people don't think this is my chest due to the fact that, you know, this sign is attached to this chest, chest but th this sign isn't attached to this one. But, I mean, it shouldn't be that difficult for people to put together that these are connected. Therefore, they're probably both mine. Ah! Yesterday I came to this one and there's a whole bunch of feathers and crap in there. And now the feathers are all gone and now there's just freaking nothing in here. It's like, what the balls, man? So stupid. So annoying. Why do people take stuff that don't that doesn't belong to them? This was not an issue. I'm kind of mad, actually. 
Because I didn't know that was empty till right now. <sighs> what? How dare you, kitty cats. So let's go take a walk down. <laughs> uh, spawn area here. Oh, well, actually. There's a whole bunch of kitty cats in here. It's kind of scary, actually. I don't know why. Oh, they're just all... Is that the same room? That's the same room. Okay, great. <laughs> These are all our farms. Oh, good lord. My frames just dropped to, like, nothing. Ugh, it's disgusting. Okay, let's get out of here. So I don't crash my freaking game or recording. Here's the new blocks. I really like them. Well, I guess we had them in, in last season as well. But I never really touched them ever. Uh, yeah, this place is actually looking really beautiful. It's a shame it's all going to come down and die. <laughs> One day, the official... Wait, the official unofficial diving board. Hold space. I, I don't know who did this, but this looks really cool as well, the lava. Actually, it's an upgraded one. When I came here last time, there was only one lava pool. And there's this very cool path that leads all the way to... What the... Why? Why, Randy, is your tunnel so important that I get its own special path, huh? Hmm? Think you could just stand up the rest of spawn like this, huh? Hmm? So those chests. Okay, so essentially, the original plan here was for... Once a full week was is done, uh, all this is going to get destroyed. But, I mean, we do need to have some kind of spawn platform, especially since spawn is over there. So what I think is going to happen here is we're going to leave most of the stuff. All the chests and I guess some of this crap is going to disappear. But for the most part, I know some of it will we'll probably keep some of it here just for convenience sake. And it looks pretty. And we do want to have some pretty thing. I just don't want, I just didn't want emphasis on stuff getting built up a on top of spawn and um someone was apparently supposed to start fixing these but it never happened <laughs> all right let's take a tumble and every time i do this it's scary it's so scary <gasps> oh there's randy Whoop. so i haven't been here in a little while either Ooh, there's another portal stuff could definitely spawn here can't it where, where's where's the light again five yeah what the balls guys come on let's get jiggy with it what's this this is Green Hippo's house. Ooh, so this is spawns being slowly pushed around. What what is all this? What? Why is there a bunch of swords? North Passage doesn't exist yet. Get that work, you lazy out. Whoa, I can't say that word. It's illegal for me to say. So I haven't really come down here in a little while. Move yo shiznit. <laughs> uh the daylight sensor switch here, which um I think MML put these here not knowing that. You know, the sun affects them. <laughs> uh, that's funny to me. I think this is Judah's house, maybe? I know Judah was talking about having a house down here. You know, this isn't too bad. I was a little bit... Well, what is, oh, you know, I bet these are the farms. Right? What is this? What is this? Holy crap. What's down here? There's a lot of change in the past day. Where are we going? Where are we going? Holy crap, I thought I saw a creeper there and it scared the heck out of me. What is this place? What are where are we? Huh. <laughs> I, I don't know what this place is, but okay, let's leave it. Hmm. Hi. I I couldn't figure out how to type hi for some reason. <laughs> uh what's over here? I, yeah, this this place has gotten so much bigger since I've been here. Like, I was here two days ago. I didn't. I wasn't able to log on yesterday, but the day before that I was on. Ooh, it looks like people are just digging out spots where the wheel push it on. Initially, a spawn the ground was just a whole bunch of stone and all that, but I had the initial the idea to um, make it uh, grass, a grass floor. Since I think it would be kind of cool if it was just kind of like you know an above ground spawn just underground and that was humble abode soon to be two by two x has humble oh two times as humble i got you i figured i figured you out it looks like it leads to a mine or some crap this reminds me a lot of um x's caving system or cave house or whatever the heck it was Ooh, this is cool it's like a crucible kind of thing i think that if you think that if you steal you win a steel medal well you don't <laughs> <laughs> the well you don't is something exactly Matt would say. Holy crap! Jeez, Matt. You got a lot of monies. Do not thief from the, the chests. Okay? Okay. He who thieves is bad. Don't get bad. Get glad. <laughs> uh, these are all very Matt-like things to say. Does that lead to the surface? No. 
Oh, yeah, it does. Ah, I keep getting random really bad itches for some reason. It's really weird. I just showered. I shouldn't be this itchy. Well, I didn't just shower, but I showered recently enough where I shouldn't be getting really itchy. All right, is there anything else around spawn? So I've been meaning to really start helping out around spawn a lot more, and I have been. Thus why I have this pick here, and that's not the only iron pick I've had. I've probably gone through three or four enchanted ones, and then another two that weren't enchanted, because I forgot that even though I only had steel tools, that I could probably enchant those. These chests got to be moved eventually. So this is the West Passer Passage off oh, the Skyfall. I believe Randy said it took him like seven hours to do this, which is crazy. I need a spot to dump my stuff. Hmm. Move your shit. <laughs> okay, let's play. Wait, what is this thing? Oh yeah, this is just. All right, this is Mr. Green Hippo's house. Interesting. Interesting. Hippo was talking about someone removed like a waterfall or not a waterfall like. He would fall into water from somewhere, and it, it's gone now, <laughs> and he died from it. My name is Sign. I'm his buddy, Cool Sign. I got gotcha. you. an East Tunnel, Hippo, Sir Iron, Raise Roof, Judah. We all did the West Passage. Ring Tail, Mess Up Clearing. Okay. If you guys want to read all the updates, I'll probably come read these later. So this is our temporary message board until someone makes it better and not super ugly. I'm just kidding. It's not ugly. Well, I mean, it, it is just dirt or stone. <clears throat> okay, let's go down here. Oh, you know what? Do I have wood? <laughs> is, there any, is this this is all public, public public blocks? Is there any wood I can steal? Yes, there is. I'll just take that. Is that all I really care so much about? I think so. Do want to be careful here. I'm gonna make a little hidey spot, a little hidey hole. Little hidey hole. Uh, oh, you know what? If I'm going to make a hidey hole, I should probably make a chest as well. I wonder if Randy will see me do this. It's possible. Um, wait, did I take a stack of jungle wood? How come I don't have a stack? What the balls, man? What the balls, man? I don't know why I'm singing about balls. What the balls, man? Uh, get out of your string. I care little about you. So little that you're a, a fiddle. Yeah, take that. <laughs> so dumb. Ooh, ooh, I'm getting a bit of leg, ain't I? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Don't you dare watch. Did I not make two chests? What? Oh, you know what? I know what happened. Because you need, you need two wood to make... Uh, chest. That's not what I meant to do. Daint. But that's okay. Daint. Because daint. Oh, oh. I need to do this quick. This Ryan doesn't see me. <laughs> that's my secret passage. This is the first bow I got in the server. When I killed a mob. I don't see, once again, I don't know if I record that or not. <laughs> no one can see me. My precious. I don't know why it's my precious, but. Okay, I'm gonna want wood. That chicken will be great. Um, I should just make another pick, to be honest. Let's take that crafting tabal. Tabal. Sure. This is actually, um, Zax's grass box. Oh, I haven't even told that story yet. Oh, let's not be stupid here. Let's take a screenshot. There we go. And this way we want to go. Um. To initially get this grass down here, we had to... Uh, pretty much make a spiral staircase of dirt from the surface down, all the way down here and it was taking like hours for it to uh, grow down and it was about maybe I don't know like three-fourths of the way done and I was like oh you know what I mean we don't need all this all these grass blocks towards the top so I started digging them out just kind of absentmindedly thinking oh I'm such a great help blah 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 and then as I slowly got down to where the grass blocks ended I freaking dug one too many oh good lord load world load I, d I dug one block too many. Oh, okay, it did load. <laughs> and it free. I was so mad because all the time that grass was growing downwards, it was just freaking ruined just like that. Just because I'm a stupid butthead. I was stupid and I was a butthead. A stupid butthead, if you will. But um, it turns out, I actually found out later that Kenny also did that. Uh, I thought that was kind of funny that we both pulled the stoop. Because I was wondering why, like, the grass, like, I left, 
I forgot my iron sword. Dang it. Oh, well, I'll just make another one. But still, stupid. And yeah, this is what the sky zone looks like, guys. You know, the water up there, if we were to break these blocks, the water would just come pooling over. I'm sure someone will do that eventually. Kind of shocked. No one has done that yet, actually. <laughs> no one's been evil enough to do it. All right, let's go see if we could find um, a spot. I'm going to... You know, even though we did just take a screenshot, I'm going to take one more. Yeah, there we go. And in the event I get lost, because that is completely possible, and I hope those 50 chickens will be fine. Um, I'm also a little bit worried about finding a cave this way, simply because I feel like people just go this way in general. Oh, this looks really cool. <gasps> Ooh. I bet I can... No. <laughs> I was going to say, I bet I can make that jump into that water. No, probably not a good idea. I can do it from here. No. Oh my god, it's a squid. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. Um, I, I guess. Well, actually, no. I didn't finish my grass story yet. So I was all sad and butthurt about the fact I completely ruined. And that's weird spawning. Rendering. I was so sad that the fact that I ruined the grass and we had to start over. But then Zax actually came and saved the day because I was talking about it in the chat. And he was like, hey, you know I have a soap touch pick, right? I was like, what? Give me grass blocks now. And I said it in that weird clown-like voice. Ah! <laughs> and so he did. And he saved it. Ooh, and he saved the day. Oh, I didn't bring coal either. What the heck? I'm so dumb. Oh, this would be a cool place to have a house. So I should probably make a um a, a sword, especially when I see areas like this. All right, uh, let's do this. You know what? I'm just gonna actually talk to you guys in a bit here once I find a cave. Since this uh, this episode is initially was initially supposed to be a caving episode anyway, so I'll see you guys in a second. Also, oh, be cool to build a house or something. But we're not concerned about that yet. And I'm back. Okay, I almost jumped directly down here, and I totally will on that lava. Oh, been terrible, terrible times. Good lord, I gave myself a heart attack just about. <laughs> All right, so um, the reason why I'm doing a caving episode is because it's kind of tradition that I always gotta do a caving episode on my second episode for some reason. I, I don't know why it's a tradition, but it is. Yeah, we're getting some block leg apparently. Okay, maybe we're getting a lot of block leg. Hmm. It's the best way to do this. I kind of almost feel like someone's been in here already. I don't really know why. There's no real clear signs of it. Geronimo! Geronimo! I did, okay, I was going to say, I did get my water back, right? Yeah, I did. Alright. <gasps> Woo! So, um, with the raised terrain... Yeah. <gasps> Ooh. There's actually been uh, a little bit of a gold rush at spawn. Hmm. Is there anything else down there? There's anything else up here? It's hard to tell, but I don't see anything. All right, let's just jump down here. Why freak not? Why the freak not? Um, due to the fact that we raised spa <laughs> the terrain by you know we doubled the terrain the base of terrain. Terrain. How many times am I going to say terrain? And because of that, we also had to double, double the ore spawn rates. Um, essentially, because, you know, if we have double the height and we have and if ore spawn double the height what they normally would, then it only makes sense that you'd want to have twice as many ores due to the fact that if we didn't, the ores would be a lot more spread out and you would not see them, like, often at all. But because we did this, what actually had an effect is that there was a whole bunch more diamonds and gold and all the very valuable things. And people already have, like, copious blocks of diamond and crap, and it's crazy. <laughs> so it's a little bit of an inflation thing, but, I mean, well, it's kind of too late now, and we kind of got to have to live with it. And the rich will get rich, and the poor will get poor, and I am a whore, and what, what am I talking about? I don't know. I'm going to go ahead and blame this leg on freaking Ringtail Rand over here. Hooligans! That's right, he's a hooligan. Wait, I was going to say, I place these torches, right? <laughs> yeah, I, I did. Yeah, yeah, I did. I did. I'm, I'm stupid. Confirmed. Confirmed for stoop. Alright, what else can I tell you guys about the new server here? Um, I've upgraded the server. 
We've actually been running on one gigabyte of RAM ever since I started this up. And people were complaining that it's a little bit laggy. The view distance on the server has been six chunks all along, and I did not even know that. I thought it was just normally set to 16. Oh, all right, I guess I need uh, another pick. Guess it's time. My time has come. But uh, honestly, I found that the server hasn't really been too bad with the... Uh, just having one gigabyte of RAM, and I didn't really think it was worth it to upgrade, especially when we it's very often that we don't have many people on. Um, but recently, like, even actually, even when we had the big, like, s s uh, server tour final event thing, and even when we had like everyone at the uh, meets when we when we actually reset the server, that's another thing. Um, I believe that was the first time I think Hippo brought this up. That it was the first time everyone in our on the unoriginal craft server was actually at the server we set. That's crazy. I did, I did not even realize that happened, and that's actually really cool. And I'm really happy that happened because it was really fun, and it wasn't actually as chaotic as I thought it would be. It was still pretty freaking chaotic. Well, you guys already know from seeing the episode, but it wasn't as terrible or not terrible, but it wasn't as crazy as I thought it would be. So that's cool. But yeah. So the server's been upgraded from one gigabyte of RAM to three. Ooh, I almost jumped. And uh, I also changed the view distance from 6 chunks to 16 chunks. So that's a pretty big freaking jump. I've been hearing some people having a bit of leg issues, mostly Zach's, but he's our across the seas guy, the only guy we have from uh, Europe. Or just, you know, that isn't from North America. I hope this leads somewhere. Come on, Cecil Lava. I need you to do things. Can you do that for me, Lava? Oh, you did things! Yay! Thank you, Lava. You're the best. Give me all the things. Hopefully not. Oh, okay. I thought that was just my water leg. Oh, great. Oh, great. Oh, no. Oh, Nelly. Um, oh, why, why did I just get pushed back there? I wasn't even touching the water. Well, I guess I kind of am. You know, squint your eyes and crap. Um, so yeah, the render distance has been increased by a lot. I did that mostly because people were complaining that there's not very many mobs at night. And I did notice that too, but there haven't been many mobs. And the main reason people are thinking that is just because the render distance isn't very high. Hi, hello. <laughs> so I increased that. Dang it. Is that a, what is that, chicken? You a chicken? Is that just a torch? No, yeah, just a torch. Alright, oh look, there's an ender fart. I was gonna call him an ender fat, but then I realized that doesn't make any sense and it's dumb. Ah! Dang it! Ah, oh, this always happens to me! Alright, I'm gonna go find another cave, so I'll be right back, everybody. Okay, I'm back. So the re ravine's just down there. I think I might have found some over here. I kinda wanna drop down. I feel like it might kill me as well. <laughs> a little bit worried about that. Well, I mean, YOLO, am I right? What, what could I possibly lose? <laughs> Besides my life. Should I do it? I think I should survive that fall. Whee! Oh. Whee! Oh, oh. Hey, I'm okay. Is there anything this way? Did I come over here for nothing? Hello, creeper. Hello. You are my savior or something. You're, you're my, like my little freaking light that's like, Oh, right here. Pretty much where you're screaming at me, man. Ooh, look, it's another ravine. It goes, n yeah, it goes nowhere. Dang it. Uh, hmm. I wonder. You look like a good guy. You hate me. You suck. <laughs> I should have hit him with my sword. I'm sorry. I should have. I should have just bonked your nose with my fist. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I should have done it. I want your bow. Give me your bow. Ah, so I've been looking for... Ow, asshole. I've been looking for a cave for like 20 minutes now. I can't find... Ooh, is that a cave? <laughs> I doubt it. Um, I can't seem to find a cave. I don't know, guys. For some reason, I am bad at finding caves. I don't know why. But it's just a thing. I don't know if I just don't know how to look for them anymore. Or my life just sucks. It's probably what it is, to be honest. My life just probably sucks. Let's face it. <laughs> uh, okay, well, um, hmm. 
I mean, this was a rather uneventful episode now, wasn't it? That sucks. Okay, well, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. My name's Chris. This will make a nice little screenshot, I guess. The failed caving experience dot com. <laughs> Don't know why the dot com was necessary. Um, I guess maybe in the next episode I will maybe cave. <laughs> That'd be good. Whoa! Oh, three beef. Look like I got like freaking a bunch more of that. Look like I got like five or some crap. Look like I had a freaking crazy looting on this sword. Alright, I'm gonna need your food. Hi, I will take all your things, Mr. Guy. And seeing this leather, it just reminds me of trying to freaking build the arena. Good lord. I had to make so much iron ar or, uh, leather armor for it. It was insane in the membrane. Insane in the membrane. Oh, look at that. Oh, there we go. Ooh, this place is lovely as well. Let's see, look what it looks like from down here. Oh, she's the problem. I'm running out of food so much. I keep freaking, like, carelessly taking damage because I don't give a fly on fudge. I probably should. I keep seeing these red flowers. They look like glowing spider eyes to me or some crap. You know, is that just me? That just might be me. Oh, that, I, ooh, that's nice. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> okay. If you guys are, are interested in actually joining the server, there will be a link down in the description. Pretty much explaining how to do that. Essentially, all you do is you go to the video that's down there. <gasps> it's a cave, maybe. I'm going to be so mad if this cave's already been explored. It looks like it might have been. Oh, oh man. <laughs> I don't want to land on that. <gasps> and a boy. I was going to say, I better not die right now. Oh, boy. Look at this crap. Holy, there's three creepers, at least. Oh, great. The spiders. That's a great way to start. Oh, man. <laughs> uh, if you guys want to see me die in the next episode... Join in. I'll probably die. I have never successfully not died in this this places. I always I'm always okay up until I get too greedy and then I just die. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll talk to you guys later. Goodbye.